Yo, what's going on YouTube? What's going on everybody, man? Welcome back to the channel. Thank you guys for tuning in today, man. Today we're checking out Stilly Dan with Dr. Wu. Okay, haven't heard this one before, man. This was suggested. I've got a list of songs from Stilly Dan to check out, and this was the next one on that list. So let's go ahead and dive in. Check out Dr. Wu from Stilly Dan, man. Appreciate you guys for rocking with me as always, man. Before I hit play, this is a interesting cover art as I'm looking at it, man. Okay, before I hit play, don't forget to like, subscribe, check out the description. If you guys enjoy rocking with the channel, man, appreciate y'all. Let's go ahead and dive in. The chimes. Katie tried. I was halfway crucified. I was on the other side. Walked in and my life began again. Just when I'd spent the last piaster I could borrow. This piano is so nice. All night long, we would sing that stupid song. And every word we sang, I knew was true. Are you? Quick, that's over. That went quick. Oh man, what a musical gem! What a musical gem, dude. Uh, now the lyrics, some of them very um, upfront, understandable. Doctor Wu, I don't know who he's talking about, so we're gonna hope that they explain a little bit. If not, we'll pull up the lyrics and see if we could get a deeper explanation on that. But I hope they kind of expand on what this song was about uh there were points where i could have mistaken it for maybe drug references or just references to being left high and dry uh kind of ran over all again in uh, the sense of relying on somebody needing somebody only to be burnt by them again he said katie lies um 
So we're going to dive into that. But I just got to say, man, that piano and that saxophone, very magical, very enjoyable, wonderful on the song. Loved it, man. They came in just at the perfect moments. They they were they were great to hear. So let's learn a little bit more about Silly Dan, Dr. Wu, okay, and see what album this is off to. I think I might know, but let's see. Well, I, I said I think I know. Uh, apparently, it was right there. Katie Light is the name of the album, I think, right? So Katie Light is the fourth studio album. So yeah, yeah, big brain Sean right there. Um, I thought this was off something else. So it says... Uh, Dr. Wu redirects here for characters. Okay, so there's a Henry Wu from Jurassic Park. Not the same thing. Um, this was released in 1975. Okay, trying to dive down and see if there's any explanation. Number five is where Dr. Wu is. And I'm not sure that we'll get any information here about Katie Lied or Dr. Wu. But let me read over it. Oh, so here it goes. This is title and packaging. So the album's title does come from this song. Dr. Wu, Katie Lies, you can see it in her eyes. So that's literally where they pulled the, the title of the song from was from this, or the title of the album from this song. So it goes on to say that Walter Becker told Rolling Stone during the band's 2009 tour, it's about that uneasy relationship between the patient and doctor. People put faith in doctor, yet they abuse their power and become dangerous. Yeah, so interesting, man. I thought we were actually talking about maybe a romantic relationship but like i said i did get references towards being on some kind of drug well apparently we're talking about medication we're talking about an actual patient doctor relationship man so i'm still interested in pulling up the lyrics so let's check that out yeah so looking over the lyrics man uh they're not I, I don't know they're not so direct i could almost paint my own picture what i think is going on here now with the uh, context that was given in that 2009 interview uh but it probably hit us all differently that's kind of the way i see it now is he's trying to get over this relationship maybe he was down depressed really in a bad mental state this doctor helped him um and he almost got hooked on whatever it was that the doctor helped him through maybe developed an addiction to this medication or whatever and now he's feeding for it doctor you know he said uh don't seem right i've been strung out here all night i've been waiting for the taste you said you'd bring to me uh to me that makes it seem like he's falling back into a relapse of this like depression and saying dude i need that fix like i need whatever you were giving to me i've been waiting all night i'm trying to sing that song which i think is more like a metaphor for that uh, whatever helped him get over that hump and make him feel better for that bit of a time. And maybe he's in a very bad mental state saying, you know, Dr. Hu, who or Dr. Wu, are you really just a shadow of the man I once knew, right? Are you crazy? Are you high? I don't know. This relationship kind of deteriorating and almost a dependency on this doctor to help him get out of this slump. Um, that's the way I took it, but we can read into it different ways, man. So Appreciate you guys for rocking with me on this one. Thank you for the suggestion. Greatly appreciate that. If you guys enjoyed rocking out with me on this one, please don't forget to like, subscribe, check out the description. Let me know more from Stilly Dan that you guys want. Like I said, I got a list here. Don't mind adding more, man. Uh, who knows? Maybe some of your suggestions are already there, all right? Consider becoming a member here on my YouTube Patreon. As little as three bucks. Dope way to support me, man. Greatly appreciate you guys. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace.